I'll take your questions. Is it a virus? We don't know. How does it spread? Is it airborne? Airborne is a possibility. We don't know. Is this an international health hazard or a military concern? Both. Are these people alive or dead? Hold them down! We don't know. Is that true? It's a pretty good turnout. It's a pretty good turnout, and, and a lot of people went to a lot of work to get to look like this, don't you think? And I think so, especially that guy over there. Yeah, you and I, you and I went to no trouble. I didn't think this many people were going to show up. Well, thank you, Joe. I appreciate your confidence in me. You even made the news. Look at that. I made the news, yeah. Well, that's not uncommon. Um, what we're doing out here tonight, we're, it's, it's sort of a celebration of the cczombiewalk.org, or you can visit fatpossum.blogspot.com and learn a little bit more about what this is about. These folks are attending a midnight showing of Night of the Living Dead, the 1990 version with the barber that kicks ass, not the wussy barber we're all used to. And um, these guys are, are raising money. They've all paid a ticket admission price to get to come out here and walk the mall just like they did in Dawn of the Dead. And uh, we're, we're contributing that money to the Dias de los Muertos to be held on November 1st. First, we're planning a giant get together. Dias de los Muertos, you say it. I don't know how. Dias de los Muertos. That's pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. Because I'm Mexican too. Yeah. You say it better than I do. Well, that's because I have an inner Mexican deep within me. Yeah, I think you really are. And I can eat jalapenos. What's going on there? Oh, a guy dressed like a banana. Yeah? It's a banana? Yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> it's a big yellow long thing, and I think that's what's important. Oh, there's Jim. Come over here, Jim, and I'll talk to you on the TV. How are you, Jim? Uh, feeling a little dead. Feeling a little uh, dead? <laughs> Having dead issues here today. Yeah. How you been? Um, been pretty good. Pretty good. And, and, and you're behind some of this. Yes, I am. Um, with the USS Joan of Arc, the local chapter of the International Star Trek Fan Society. And it took the Trekkies to bring something like this to Corpus Christi. We're not just Star Trek. We love all horror, sci-fi, um, anything you can name that's in that genre. We're into it. And we're, we're showing Corpus Christi that tonight. So where's this, all, where's this all coming to? Well, uh, this is going to be a fundraiser to build funds for all the permits and security and everything we need for a full day-long Day of the Dead Festival on November 1st. And that's going to culminate in a mile-long zombie walk along Shoreline that's going to end at the House of Rock where they're going to be having their zombie prom. And uh, we're going to have a ton of fun, all kinds of events going on all day long, and finishing up with the Big Bang with that. The Big Bang? The Big Bang with that, you know, the big zombie walk. Oh, I thing. thought you meant like the creation of the universe. Um, mm, that's not oh, quite. I wish you were. And we're going to be showing Night of the Living Dead, the 1990 version, right at the theater behind me, the Discount Cinema. Yeah. We... Told you so. Hey, am I right? Yes. Come over here, Chris Back Toby. I got you on the air because you freak out more than anybody else in front of a camera. <laughs> How are you? Fine, Feeling down know. in blue? Yeah. All right, that's yeah. terrific. I need to eat more iron. I have no hemoglobin. Well, go get some that's all over the place. It's dripping out oh here. Also, I want to thank the folks at the Gold Exchange 2007 South Staples. And I want to tell you what, now, now the movie tonight uh, that we're watching was supposed to be Night of the Living Dead. I kind of seriously doubt it is because somebody walked off with my copy of it. And uh, I even had the people at the Gold Exchange looking for it, and they couldn't find a copy of it. And they've got every damn movie ever at the Gold Exchange, most of them less than $4, 2007 South Staples. I hope you're having a great time at home. We're having a great time out here at the Sunrise Mall. Thank you for doing that. Yes, yes. Find work. I'm Phil Dixon, and you're watching Chill with Phil. God bless you for doing so. They're coming to get you, Barbara. Stop it! You're acting like a child! Look, they're coming for you! Look! There comes one of them now! All right, you're watching Chill with Phil. I certainly appreciate you staying up late and doing so. And I want to thank the people who always make my show pop possible. Among them, Dr. Nerd Computers, 814-NERD. And your computer does go dead, and it will. They can bring it back to life for just $60. That's Dr. Nerd Computer, Weber at Everhart, right across from the Christie Estates apartments. And uh, speaking of that, I want to give a big shout out to my friend Gary. Gary, uh, you came in really, really useful this week, and I greatly appreciate you helping me out in my hour of need. And uh, these guys are here at the Sunrise Mall for Mall the Mall Zombie Walk 2007, a prelude to Dios de los Puertos coming in November. Now, 
I've got some exciting things for you. I've got a brown bag chock full of fun, and each one of those brown bags chock full of fun, in addition to things from the Wildwood Bookstore all the way out in Aransas Pass, and from the CT Sparkling City Comedy Club right downstairs here at the Sunrise Mall. I've got free passes to go see that, and I've got tickets to Steel Thunder Monster Trucks. And here's what you gotta do. You gotta call me right now at 600 P-H-I-L, 600 Phil, and ask this simple trivia question. What was Dwayne Jones, the star of the original Night of the Living Dead, what was his second movie second and only other movie that he ever made besides night of the living dead that's dwayne jones call me at 600 phil answer that question for me and i'll give you a brown bag chock full of fun meanwhile let's get back to the movie i'm phil dixon what do you want what do you want from me <laughs> Wait, baby. Doing? doing great so uh, what brings you out here nothing much just eating some people uh, wow uh you're the cutest dead girl i've ever seen thanks want a bone yeah <laughs> inside the theater watching Night of the Living Dead, the one with the non-wussy zombie butt-kicking Barbara that we've all come to know and love. Now, I'm Phil Dixon, and you're watching Chill with Phil, and I thank you for doing so, and here's what you need to do. Right now, I've got another brown bag chock full of fun. Inside each and every one of those are monstrous killer prizes. There's a thirsty zombie in front of me, and he's drinking sparkling mineral water. Just step forward, please. Just, just come on. No, come on. No, no, no. I mean... It's tough to be dead, but nine out of ten dead kids prefer Don Sonny. <laughs> Dial 600 P H I L 600 Phil 600 Phil, and tell me what kind of car was Barbara driving away from the cemetery in the original Night of the Living Dead? The kind of car, the make and model. I'll give you two bags. You know, I really don't mind if you do that. Just go, go right ahead. That, that kind of gives me a special feeling. I, a, 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 a dead, cold, fuzzy, you know what I mean? What I need is some more zombies, some more of the undead to please come eat me. We're going to film the final segment of the show that's going to air in about an hour on KTOV, Channel 21. That's 15 on most of the cable channels. The November 1st, Dios de los Muertos celebration, in which this is a fundraiser and a small part of. Guys, I want to appreciate you so much staying up and watching Chill with Phil. We have got so many good things coming up on April 15th. Watch us as we try very hard to present loose change and political commentary from conspiracy theorists around the coastal bend. Watch next week for some other damn movie I've got lined up. All right. I want to thank the Gold Exchange, 2007 South Staples, for making this possible. Remember, if you like these kind of movies, they got every single movie ever, ever made on DVD, on VHS, less than about $4. It is a hell of a deal at the Gold Exchange, 2007 South Staples. Dr. Nerd Computers, 814-NERD. When your computer dies, they can bring it back to life miraculously for only $65. Also, by Dr. Ray Samaniego, been my chiropractor for 15 years. Keeps the life energy flowing throughout my body through spi proper spinal manipulation. That's 855-1155. I want to thank the Wildwood Bookstore all the way out in Aransas Pass, and I want to thank the good people at Yummies. If you wake up hungry, in the middle of your death. Remember, Yummies is open late, and they are going through right now. You give them a holler, 777-1950. My name is Fo oh, 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 coming up next week on Chill with Phil. It is going to be the... I want to say... <coughs> Stay on top.